I'm Courtney Layton and today we're at the Thrill of the Hunt, a new consignment store here in Winterville. So let's take a look at what they have to offer. Hi, I'm Teresa Harrell. I was born and raised here in Pitt County. Um, never moved off except for a short distance to Craven County for a short while, but come back to Pitt County and been here ever since. It's always been about the thrill of the hunt for me when I'd always go out thrifting and looking for things for myself. Um, and sometimes people would offer buy the whole box lot for that one thing. And I got a lot of those box lots. So I said, I got to get rid of it because it's starting to take over. So I decided I wanted to get a booth and I didn't start this here. I was able to get another booth at a different location and started selling there and space was limited because a waiting list is, is unheard of to want to expand. And a friend of mine had this building, so I asked her about it, so we started this. Um, when COVID hit, I had a small booth and I worked part-time. And when COVID hit, I was out of a job. And the place that I worked at didn't open until last September. So during whole COVID, this is what we did. We hustled and this was only, this was our only source of income. So we hustled to make this work. And we said, and I've always kind of wanted to open up my own shop. And we searched around, we found this one. It was small enough to where I could handle it if we wanted to do it by ourselves, or if we wanted to bring in vendors. So, and we decided to bring in vendors so we could give somebody else an opportunity to do what we love to do. A consignment store usually is where an individual bring in one or two pieces that they want to sell. And the store will take a certain percentage of what it's sold for. Here, we rent out the booth space and the vendors that we have bring in anything they want. We don't take a commission off of what they sell. What they sell is their money. They just have to pay booth rent each month. It's important because with COVID and the rising prices, this day and time, you can come in here and redecorate your house or furnish your house, not only here, but at any thrift store to, on a budget. And that's what we try to do is help people look for things or we ask them, what, is there any particular thing that you're looking for? And we'll take their name and number and call them if we find it. So they can come either look at it and get it or have the option to pass. And also on Saturdays, we offer free setup to anybody who wants to come out to set up and sell their items from their house. They're not in a good location, we are. And so they can sell and make money too. So it's kind of a win-win for everybody. Gas prices, it's a one-stop shop. So it varies because each different vendor, you know, kind of specializes in certain things. Um, we have one vendor, Cool, we call him Cool. He does a lot of house cleanouts, older houses, so he gets a lot of old furniture. Bet she does more of the country type stuff. Um, Jim, he's kind of eclectic. He likes the older stuff also. Same thing with um, Dave and Vicki. They, it's just kind of a mixture for them. Um, Keith, the same way. It, it's just a mixture of things that we find that we think is cool that we could sell that somebody else will think 
that's cool. So I like the older stuff. Give me the older nostalgic stuff, like the old radios, the old sewing machines, just, um, mm, it, it's kind of hard. I'm just an old soul at heart, even though I am older, but I've always loved the older antiques, things that remind me of my grandma. Yeah.